Archie. Welcome back to my channel. I think you just saw the big guy. Uh, I'll tell you why the big guy's hanging around right here in just one second. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you. I hope you are having a fantastic day. It's Jody Dunn. And I'm coming at you with my Walgreens haul. So, so excited. Also, look out in this video. You will see a clip popped up because I did announce a gift card uh, giveaway last week. And we are announcing the winner today. So the winner will win a $20 gift card to your choice of stores. So make sure you watch the video in its entirety and look out for that clip announcing the winner. Thank you all so much who entered into that giveaway. And you know, I love to do gift card giveaways on this channel. So look out for the next one coming soon. If you're new and you just found the channel, I'm so excited that you are here. Is he gonna stop barking? Would you please let me know that you are new and say hello right down there so that I can welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. Super excited you are here. And if you are already subscribed, thanks so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Let me know if you plan on doing any Walgreens shopping this week. Um, two of my accounts, I think. I have three accounts at Walgreens. Two of them got a $10 off when you spend 30. It does say pickup offer, but those coupons have been working in store. So I definitely plan on trying that out today. Super duper excited. Looks like we got some good deals again this week. Um, so we are going to head into the store, but before we do, I just had to show you a couple of things and I wanted to give, uh, he's almost knocking the dang tree over again because there's kids riding bikes by, by the way, I got my hair done. Some of y'all commented on my Dollar General video from yesterday with compliments. Thank you. I hadn't been to the salon since October of 2019. I finally went back. Obviously it needed a trim and hallelujah, I'm blonde again. <laughs> I almost, I couldn't believe how dark my actual natural color was since I hadn't got it done for 14 months. Pretty much that was my natural color that you've been seeing for all these months. And I almost was going to just kind of keep it dark. And then I was like, no, I love to be blonde. So make me blonde again. So she did. And it's because it's shorter. It's like extra extra big hair right now. The curl just curls right up. All right. A uh, couple of things I do want to shout out and say thank you. Uh, I just dropped something. Hang on. All right. I got, I stopped at my PO box and <laughs> oh, you guys are just so dang fabulous. I love you and appreciate you. <laughs> Krista sent me a Christmas card. Thank you so much for thinking of me, Krista. I appreciate you. Michelle, Michelle sent me a Christmas card and a few coupons. Thank you so much, Michelle. I appreciate you. You guys are going to crack up at this one. Well, probably not crack up. I thought it was so awesome. Oh my gosh. My friend Amy from Amy's Way to Save. I have mentioned her channel um, before on my channel. She is just so dang sweet. Go check her channel out. She does some really awesome videos not only um, like drugstore couponing like I do, but she does some other like grocery budgeting videos, which are really awesome. So go check out her channel. Thank you so much, Amy. She sent me a Christmas card and a couple of coupons. That was so sweet of you to share your coupons with me. All right, I cracked up when I opened this one. Uh, Denise, thank you, Denise. Denise sent me a package and I opened the card and basically, the card says, Merry Christmas, Jody, dear Gus. <laughs> dear Gus, I hope you enjoy your holiday treats. I look forward to seeing you in the videos and your mom. <laughs> so dang fantastic. She sent a whole bag of treats for Gus. And Denise, I have to tell you, uh, you probably already saw, but I was picking these up for a while at the Dollar General when they were money makers. And these happen to be Gus's favorite treats. He won't eat those dang nudges at all that I've been getting for free from Walmart. He won't touch them. He loves these treats and we just ran out. <laughs> and I was kind of like, oh, I don't want to pay for them because I got them for a moneymaker for so long. So Denise, we already opened up and, and gave Gus one. He is thrilled with you. He loves you. You are his new best friend. Thank you so much, Denise. <laughs> 
you guys I have to show you. I showed you a few weeks ago. Um, my friend Kelsey had made me a shirt. <sighs> she made me a couple more. So dang sweet of her. Look at how beautiful this print is. Can you see this like leopard print? And of course it has the saying that she put on my other shirt. Pro tip gratitude. I can't wait to wear this one. I actually love red. Um, she sent me a couple more pro tip gratitudes. Oh my gosh. She loaded me, loaded me with the wet wipes. These are going in the car. Thank you, Kelsey. I appreciate you. And Michael and Sawyer. She sent us some fuzzy socks. I let the girls pick out. Don already picked her color. Viv's taking blue. I'm taking pink. You guys. Oh. Yes, Kelsey, I did cry. Yes. This shirt says, only the best moms get promoted to grandma. How dang sweet is this? And y'all know my grandson is coming soon. If you are a soon-to-be mom and you are looking for a, an awesome gift for your mother, let me tell you, this will definitely bring tears to her eyes. I will pop Kelsey's Instagram information up on the screen if you do want to contact her. These shirts are really nice, soft shirts. And just how dang cute is that? It's just so sweet. Oh, thank you so much, Kelsey and Baxters. I appreciate you. All right. I know that was a super duper long intro. We are going to head into the Walgreens and see what deals we are going to pick up today. Thank you again to all of you. I just appreciate you. I mean, I appreciate you just giving the video thumbs up and, and liking, um, liking the videos, commenting on the videos. It just all means so much to me. Thank you all for all of your support. And to those of you that actually sent something to me, which was like so not expected, thank you. I appreciate you. And again, Denise, you are now Gus's new best friend. <laughs> All right, let's head into Walgreens. Of course, we will debrief at the kitchen table. I'll show you my receipts. Let's see what deals we are going to pick up. If you do enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you. And uh, let's get into it. Let's get it. All right, we are in the Walgreens on Sunday, the 27th, to do some weekly deals. Super excited about this first deal. It is another gift card promotion with Activate Rewards. So, so excited. Several of you told me about it. Plus, I've seen it in a couple of ads for different stores. So, it involves a whole bunch of different products. I will go over that with you at the debrief. But I'm going to go for the Neutrogena Facial Care because I have some great digital coupons for this. So I'm going to grab this for $22.99. I have a $10 digital coupon. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab two of the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Wipes. They are $6.99 each, but they are buy one, get one half price. And I have a $5 digital coupon off of two Neutrogena wipes that should apply to this as well. So total for these three products is $33.47. Now I am working with a $10 off when you spend $30 on pickup order, which we know has been working in stores. So I'm testing it today to make sure it's still working in stores. And then there is a unadvertised Catalina promotion for five, a $5 register reward when you spend $25 on Aveeno, Clean and Clear, and Neutrogena. And then for spending $25 in these products, I'm going to submit my receipt to activate rewards to get back a $10 gift card. So without factoring in the $10 off $30, that would make my cost $347. But it will actually, it should actually be a little money maker with factoring that 10 off 30 in. In addition, I am working with a booster that is spend 20, earn $5 in Walgreens cash. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to build my transaction up so I can use Walgreens cash to pay and still earn my Walgreens cash back. So I'm going to go ahead and do this deal again. It is back. Spend 20 on select Venus and Gillette razors or refills and earn back $10 in Walgreens cash. So I'm going to go ahead and pick this one up for $12.99. I have a $5 digital coupon for that one. 
And then I'm gonna pick up one of the men's at $12.99. And I also have another $5 digital coupon. And I'm spending a little more than 20. I showed you the calculations previously because I have to account for that 10 off 30 coming off, which is a store coupon and will not count towards my spend deal. I'm gonna link that video in the description box where I explained that because you don't want your store coupons affecting your spend deals. I decided to change my breakdown around because there was a product I really wanna try. So I'm gonna put that $22.99 um, moisturizer back and instead I'm gonna grab this eye cream for $20.99, which my digital coupon does apply to that as well. And this will lower my out of pocket a little as well. So now my total for Neutrogena products is $31.47 and my total for the Venus Razor and Gillette Razor is $25.98 for a grand total of $57.45. My $10 off when you spend 30 should come off. Then I have my $10 off digital for Neutrogena and my $5 digital for Neutrogena. And then my two $5 digitals for Gillette. That should bring me down to $22.45. Since my coupons are $20, that qualifies me to earn back $10 in Walgreens cash for spending 20 on the Gillette and Venus and $5 in Walgreens cash for spending um, $20, so that booster I'm working with. So I'm going to use $20 in Walgreens cash and pay a subtotal of $2.45. I am going to get back uh, the $15 in Walgreens cash, $5 register reward, and a $10 gift card, which should make this a huge like $7 money maker. All right, let's announce the winner of the $20 gift card. Laura, oh, I'm so, I'm not even gonna try to say your last name. Pendergra Pendergast, maybe? <laughs> I just tried to say it. I hope I didn't mess that up too bad. You are the winner of the $20 gift card. I just need you to send me an email and also comment below so that I know it's you claiming it and I will get you your $20 gift card. My email is up on the screen and in the description box. All right, let's move on to our second transaction. Again, I am working with a 10 off when you spend 30 pickup order. This is a separate account and a $5 back when you spend 20 on um, when you spend 20. <laughs> so again, I'm going to build my transaction up. I'm going to go ahead and grab these Gillette razors for $8.29. They are on promotion for when you buy two products, you earn back $4 in Walgreens cash. And I have a $5 digital coupon for the razors. The shave gel is also included. So this will be my half priced product. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab this one for $3.49, which will actually ring up half price. And I have a $1 digital coupon for this. So these two total me 1003 after my digital coupons. That'll bring me down to 403, earning back $4 in Walgreens cash. All right, to add to this transaction, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up some Scott paper towel. No, I'm gonna pick up some Scott toilet paper, the Comfort Plus. The paper towel is also included in the buy one, get one half price sale. So these two are gonna to total me $7.50. I do have a five times back the rewards on Fetch, so I'll scan my receipt for that. And then since I don't have any coupons for these two, I am going to use two register rewards to help lower my out of pocket, a $2.50 and a $3. And of course, you know, since I'm using digitals and register rewards, I'm gambling that my digitals may not come off. We've got a couple of great deals this week. So the pop is on sale again, three for $9.99. This store's totally wiped out of Coke, regular Coke. So I'm gonna wait until they restock later in the week to grab these. We also have a pretty good deal. They run this, I don't know, once a month or a couple times a month, but unfortunately the store was also out of something I wanted. But the Smucker's Jelly and the Jif Peanut Butter, they didn't have any of the regular Jif Peanut Butter, they are on sale two for $4. I always like to try to stock up on the peanut butter when it goes on sale and the jelly. They also have a great promotion on the Doritos and Lay's. They are on sale three for six, which that's a great price, $2 a pack. They had none of the regular Doritos. <laughs> I wanted to grab some regular Doritos and the blue kinds. The Lay's are included as well. And we also have, um, it's not marked here, but the DiGiorno is buy one, get one free. They're $6.99 each. And remember, I showed you last week there is a new Catalina promotion where you do get a register reward back if you buy two, three, or four of the DiGiorno pizzas. 
that does not start till tomorrow. So I might pick up a couple of those, but I'm gonna wait until that Catalina promotion starts to giving back the register reward. So the Christmas items are 50% off. My store really did not have a lot of stuff. They're pretty wiped clean. I was kind of surprised. So let me know what your clearance section looks like at your store. I looked for a second, but there really wasn't anything that I was like super excited about. All right, we're gonna end this transaction with some L'Oreal makeup. I have some great digital coupons for these products. And I saw in the ad that they were um, earn a $5 register reward when you spend 15 um, on these products, even though it's not tagged in my store, it is in the ad and they are buy one, get one half price. So I'm going to go ahead and grab three of them, even though they're buy one, get one half price. I'm just going to grab three of them for $10 and 49 cents. And the ad does say the register reward is for eye cosmetics only. So I'm, since L'Oreal was <laughs> included, I'm just gambling to see if I actually get it. So three of these at buy one, get one half price is gonna total me $26.22. I have a $4 off one digital coupon and I have a $6 off two digital coupon. So total for this transaction is $43.75. My $10 off when you spend $30 will come off first, bringing me down to $33.75. And remember, I have to spend $20 to earn back that $5 in Walgreens cash. So I still can use some Walgreens cash to pay for this. So after all my digital coupons and the two register rewards come off, that should bring me down to $12.25. I'm going to go ahead and use $10 in Walgreens cash to pay for this. And I should get back $9 in Walgreens cash, plus a little bit more because I have the birthday booster clipped on this account uh, and a $5 register reward. Let's get to the kitchen table and see how everything turned out. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with these two transactions. Uh, we had some funky things happen. Um, so I got some really good updates for you on these transactions. So in the first transaction I showed you in the store, I wanted to take advantage of the awesome gift card promotion from Activate Rewards. It includes several different products. I will pop a picture up on the screen. You guys know there was a promotion that I did last week. This is a new one. Um, but I did one last week for the Listerine products and I got approved in like two days. My gift card came through. So Activate Rewards is usually super quick about it. Um, but basically it is if you spend somewhere between $15 and $24.99, you earn back $5 in a Visa gift card. Or if you spend $25 or more, you earn back $10. It is a limit of three per household and again it has just a wide range of products that it includes so i went ahead and did the neutrogena and it will tell you when you go to the website there is a button you can click on to see what products actually qualify with the barcode so i make sure that my products that i'm purchasing qualify for the promotion there are just a ton so i did the neutrogena and then I went ahead and did the Gillette Venus deal because I was building my transaction up so I could pay as little cash out of pocket and still earn back all of my Walgreens cash because we know when product deals are coded as spend, even though some channels may tell you you cannot use Walgreens cash on a spend deal, you certainly can. I will leave the link in the description box with a Walgreens playlist. I did a video quite a while back that is titled, it's in that playlist and it's titled, Yes, You Can Use Points on a Spend Deal. Obviously now it's called Walgreens Cash, but it's the same principle. So all the Neutrogena products are buy one, get one half price. Um, and then the Gillette's were on sale for $12.99 each. So there is my, the eye gel at $20.99 and then one of my makeup remover wipes rang up for half price. There's my two Venus and then my other makeup remover wipe um, rang up for regular price. I could have got another one if I wanted at half price, but I just chose to do it this way. 
My 10 off 30 did come off, so those are still working in store. My $10 off the Hydro Boost came off, my $5 off the Venus, my $5 off the Gillette, and then dang it, I must have had a $3 um, Neutrogena wipes coupon clip. So my $5 didn't come off. My $3 came off. So my subtotal was $24.45. I was expecting it to be $22.45, but that's okay. I did go ahead and use $20 in Walgreens cash to pay for this. So I used $20 in Walgreens cash. This is the account that I don't use very often. And I did earn back $15 in Walgreens cash. I earned back $10 for spending $20 on the Gillette and Venus products and $5 for spending $20, that um, generic digital spend booster that I got. So, so you can see that you can use Walgreens cash to pay and still earn back Walgreens cash. So instead of paying $2.45 out of pocket, I paid $4.45, which is kind of a bummer, but I didn't realize I had that digital coupon clipped. I did not get a $5 register reward. What I did get was, first of all, the Catalina gave me a spend seven, or spend 30, earn $7 in Walgreens cash. These ones, you cannot use Walgreens cash on. The paper Catalina boosters, they will not work. So it's not the same as the product spend deals or the digital spend boosters. I got this, which looks like a new Catalina promotion. Get three when you spend 15 on these participating products, hand and body items. This is what I got instead of a register reward, OMG. $5 off your next purchase of personal care items only. So instead of getting a register reward, I actually got a coupon for $5 off my next purchase. So that was a little odd to me. Now, if you do get these coupons, I will caution you, I have not used this yet, but I am pretty certain this is gonna show up as a store discount. So if you are working with spend boosters, um, any spend deals, this is gonna show up as a store discount and store coupons do not count towards your spend total. So beware of that. So little odd, this is the third time I've done the Neutrogena deal. The first time, I did get the $5 register reward. The second time I did not, I submitted to Catalina. I'm waiting to hear back from them. And now the third time I get a $5 off coupon. So very curious about what is happening. I'm not sure if they're changing where it says, you know, $5 off your next purchase. Now that Catalina promotion that runs through the 10th of January and it is only good at Walgreens and Dwayne Reed, which I think is like a sister store of Walgreens from what I understand. So there was that transaction. Then I went ahead and did my second transaction, which was the Scott paper towel. I went ahead and picked up the L'Oreal because that again showed in the ad, $5 register reward when you purchase $15. And we know when we're getting back a register reward, it doesn't matter how we pay. And then I grabbed the two Gillette. So the only spend deal I was working with on this one was the spend 20 earn $5 in Walgreens cash. So let's take a look at my receipt. I was using register rewards in here. And I promise you, I had the cashier scan the toilet paper first because I wanted my register rewards to attach to those items. It does not show that on the receipt. There is my Gillette razor, and then there is my shave gel for $174 at half price. There is my Scott paper towel, buy one, get one half price. And then my L'Oreal, buy one, get one half price. And then my regular one. So my 10 off 30 did come off. My six off of two L'Oreal coupon came off. My $4 off one L'Oreal coupon came off. And my $1 off one Gillette um, shave gel came off. My $5 off the Gillette razors did not come off. Most likely because one of these register rewards here attached to the Gillette razor instead of the toilet paper, which will kick out your digital. So my dang subtotal was $17.25. It should have been $12.25. I did go ahead and use $10 in Walgreens cash because I needed to spend $20 and I was at 10 
um, 15, 16, 50. And so I could use $10 in Walgreens cash there. And I did earn back $11 in Walgreens cash. Four for purchasing the two products here. And um, $5 for spending 20 and then a few extra dollars for um, like $2 for the 10 times the birthday month. So I did contact Walgreens, um, did an online chat like I always do, I never call, and they did issue me the $5 in Walgreens cash for my digital coupon not coming off. So what I got for this transaction was I got another spend 30 and seven, and then OMG. I did not get a register reward, instead I got a $5 off coupon again. So the ad is a little deceiving because it literally says register reward. This is not a register reward because register rewards you can use on any products you want. This is $5 off when you purchase Color Cosmetics. And again, this is probably going to show up as a store discount versus the register rewards that show up as manufacturer coupons. So the totals, I thought I was going to have a little freebie here. didn't work out that way because I'm not going to count those coupons that I got as rewards back because they're coupons. Um, I know register rewards are coupons as well, but you can use them on any product, which makes it really nice. So it still ended up working out pretty good. Um, basically, what I ended up paying before any Walgreens cash was factored in was $47.20 is what all of these cost me after my coupons. I did earn back $26.50 in Walgreens cash plus another $5 in Walgreens cash that they issued me for my digital coupon not coming off of Gillette and then submitted for my $10 Visa gift card from Activate Rewards. Plus I scanned my receipt to fetch rewards. I got points for the Scott and for the L'Oreal. So I got like 63 cents back. So it brings my cost down to $5, like $5 even. <laughs> Which if I would have gotten the two register rewards, like I thought they were gonna be register rewards, this would have been a $5 money maker. But instead I got coupons. So definitely wanted to give you guys the heads up when they are saying register rewards now and it's only at Walgreens versus an actual Catalina promotion, um, they're actually giving back coupons. It's not working the same way with like the Crest deal this week. That's actually giving back a register reward. Um, but these little other ones are weird. So basically, I'm just looking at it as I paid $5 for my Scott toilet paper. Makes them $2.50 each. That's a pretty decent deal. I got everything else for free, so I'm pretty happy with that. So there you go. That's what I got for you today in my Sunday Walgreens haul. I would love to hear what you are picking up. Share your deals down in the comments. Congratulations again to the winner of the $20 gift card. And that's what I got for you today. I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.